Dear viewers, greetings. In this present video, we are going to see about potassium hydroxide wet mount. In short form, it is called as KOH wet mount. The aim of the KOH wet mount uh, is to visualize the fungal element present in the clinical specimens like uh, skin, hair and nail. A next principle, uh, potassium hydroxide or KOH preparation is used for the rapid detection of fungal elements in the clinical specimens as it clears the specimen making the fungal element more visible during the direct microscopic examination. The potassium hydroxide solution is alkaline and has the ability to dissolve the keratin that is uh, scrapped from the outer layer of the skin or nail or hair. As the KOH dissolves, the material binding the skin cells together and fungus present is released. Uh, this allows for the identification of organisms such as dimetophytes. Uh, in KOH wet mount, the affected skin or nail is uh, gently scrapped with a small scalpel or the edge of a glass slide. The scrappings from the skin are placed on a microscopic slide and a few drops of uh, potassium hydroxide that is about uh, 10 to 20 percentage of potassium hydroxide solution are added. A cover slip is placed over the KOH digested sample and the slide is heated for a short time. And then the slide was incubated for 5 to 10 minutes and the slide is examined under the microscope without staining. The potassium hydroxide is a highly corrosive uh, deliquid chemical so therefore it should be handled with a great care. The materials required for the KOH wet mount are uh, clinical specimens like skin, nail, hair or sputum, uh, potassium hydroxide, scalpel, Bunsen burner, teasing needle, glass slide, cover slip and microscope. The test procedure. Uh, first, uh, place the clinical specimens like uh, skin, nail, hair or sputum on the clean glass slide and uh, pour a drop of 10 to 20 percentage of uh, potassium hydroxide on the specimen and place a cover slip over it. And then uh, heat the KOH digested sample containing the slide gently over the flame. And then uh, incubate the slide for 5 to 10 minutes or place the slide in a petri dish or other container with a lid uh, together with a, a damp piece of filter paper or cotton wool to prevent the preparation from drying out. And finally, observe the slide without any staining under the microscope at 40x objective lens. Observation and results. Uh, different fungal elements like uh, hyphae, pseudo hyphae, yeast cells, uh, spores, uh, spherules and sclerotic bodies can be seen clearly in a KOH wet mount. In dermatophytosis, arthrophores develop and form as a hyphae break apart and appears as a linear chain of uh, small round to rectangular highly refractive structures. In KOH preparation of sputum, the fungus appears as not non-pigmented uh, septate hyphae 3 to 5 micrometer in diameter with uh, characteristic uh, dicto dichotomous branching and an irregular outline. And next, uh, KOH preparation is used for the diagnosis of ringworm infection. And the laboratory diagnosis of uh, tinea rests on the identification of an organism uh, by microscopic examination of uh, skin or nail scrapings with 10% to 20% uh, KOH on wet mode examination. Uh, KOH with blue black ink preparation is recommended if malaysia furfur is suspected. And finally, a calcofluor white potassium hydroxide preparation can be used for the examination of fungal infection because uh, calcofluor white is a non specific strain. And appreciation for fungal element morphology on direct examination is crucial for adequate specimen interpretation. And this image shows the KOH weight mount of Candida species. Dear viewers, thank you for your support. Thank you.